really got to do this with the mask on? Yes. Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. Your dad used to give me that exact same look. thinking miles this is not on you we can't let him live up here it's just another kind of prison it's not that easy never said it was but sometimes you got to push the past away so you can make room for the future that's actually why I call need your help getting something could get it myself but Parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Hello? Behind us. Oof. I'm in scary. Getting some? My mask. How did you? Hey, Miles. That Lee business? Don't be stupid. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. <coughs> <coughs> Miles. I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? Our school, college, anyone you like? I don't know. So there is someone. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code for my suit. Oh. Heard it over here. Why'd you say that to me? <laughs> but for real though. <laughs> oh god. Is it over here? Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. What the fuck? Don't cheat. Take your time. What the hell is this? The half the feedback is actually fighting me on doing that. It's kind of cool. Dog. Oh. Another gate. Damn, this controller is so cool, man. How Spider Man 2? Really good. Like, really, really good. It's awesome. You should have seen me when I first started playing. You should be seeing how to get it's like crying. <laughs> it was all tears of joy. Tell me what this is. Nope. All suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Oh. Could definitely use this. I just keep like the defaults because I like I just like them so much. But no, if there's one that back around here somewhere. one of them catches my eye, I'll definitely switch to one of those costumes for sure. All right. Yo, so it's like Spider Verse. Yo. I love that he's got blue kicks, because I have blue kicks like that, exactly. So now I can do that if I'm gonna be civilian Miles. Hey Miles, 
What's up? Minus hey, the good to see you. dreads of the fade. My phone. Am I allowed to play this on stream? It works right. You can't hear the music. No, dude, no, don't DMC me. No, please. Hey, you made it. Mr. At least not here yet. About that computational physics program. We got your missing person report half an hour ago. What happened? Uh oh. I gotta go Spider Man. PlayStation Man 2. I just heard two words missing in person. So I'm gonna say yes. Go ahead. We'll save your seat. Thanks, Genki. Gotta catch up to the principal. I wonder. Well, I know I to get close to the principal. What if I just press the button by accident and people just like okay. see me go invisible out of nowhere? Yes. She left her phone behind. Is it unlocked? Have you seen any text? Here we go. Just some notifications from her fitness tracker. It's counting her steps, wherever she is. The students adore Miss Ferguson. Oh my god, my controller's dying. The pop just like popped in my head. I was like, oh hey, hey, whoa, hey, hey, whoa, hey. Alright, now we now we charging. Now we charging. I hope she's alright. Please find her. We'll do our best. Miss Ferguson's missing. Oh man. Sounds like she's still wearing her fitness tracker. I wonder if I could find that signal. Mm. Suit it up. Let's go. All right. Let's see where this fitness tracker is. Last known location, Dawson Harbor. How, how, how did you do? How did you do that? Is that from the FNSM app? Did I say that right? I think I did. Oh! oh man, gotta find Miss Ferguson first. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. No! Can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Sent you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. Camouflage. Come here, boy. Hey, yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work, and he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh, now a good time? Thanks, Genki. Now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi, oh, Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. Great. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh, well, I used to do music production. But it's been hard to find time lately. Genki here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swinging. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and thinking. Uh, the tune just kind of came to me. Interesting. And can you tell me about what's important to you in life? Being there for people when they need me. Being reliable, trustworthy, someone people can depend on. Very interesting. And finally, why do you think you'd make a great addition to our school? I don't give up. And, uh, I care about doing the right thing. Oh, I, I don't know there's another guy there. Fascinating. Well, Miles, thanks for your time. Sorry. Gotta go. Oh, I missed a cool thing. Or email. But I just phased them through a wall, so you know I got density shifting powers too. Maybe I can make the BB in time to meet Mr. Atlas in person and clarify some things. <laughs> All right. How do I? Guys out of the way. Oh, is there a back room entrance over here? It's right here. I can see it's right here. Oh, it's got smashed to the roof. Okay. 
Go with it hard. Sorry, CJ. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. Time to squash a spider. You're dead, Spider-Man. He's ours. You hide. I've got these guys. Fight time, fight time, fight time, fight time. Woo! All right, well, that guy's going to sleep. Come here. I know that shit hurt. Hey, didn't I buy that? Hang on a second. I thought I bought this. Oops. Maybe I didn't. I didn't. I could have sworn I did, but I didn't. This shit is so broken, man. Dunk. <laughs> night, night. Ooh! <laughs> I don't... Oh, not the recharge abilities, man. Hey, take the shit back, bum ass motherfucker, man. Night, night. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, he's done. Where did the other guy go? Look at him, man. He's, he's all tuckered out. He's, he's so tired. You took them out by yourself? That's in my job description. Ready to go? Are you going to carry me? Yes. Sure. I've carried people before. As long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you, <laughs> you won't sue me. Really did get him with that. And it looked awesome. Thanks to Spider-Man. Our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. Mm. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider-Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. What? Uh, what? Are you, are you allowed to do that? Please welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now... Back to the quad. Oh. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. I guess that's what it is. It's so confusing. <laughs> it went. Not much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So let's do this right and meet this week on campus in person. Nice. <sighs> Got a few app requests popping up on BB's campus. Thought I'd call you directly. Okay, can I can I move? Hmm. There's more. But uh I've already played as miles enough, so I gotta switch to Peter now. Peter switching time. Is he doing uh, crunches on the, the building? Nope. I love it, I love it, I love it. This might just be my favorite game ever. Ever made, ever made. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. Hmm. I didn't read that. Did that say Emily May Foundation? I got lost in translation. It's a pretty cool building, though. That's Emily's tree. Mm. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this but my dad was the one who you know he made all the arrangements peter parker <laughs> oh my god he's green he's got a green suit underneath the green green thing goblin the far cry from that 
chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Hmm. We get palm trees here. Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. It's weird thing. He's showing emotion for once. Mr. Osborne. Let's go exploring. God, this is painful. So the first <laughs> is downstairs. Harry, he's a goober. He is a bit of a goober. A little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment? But when I got out, I made a few changes. Oh my god, this is an elevator. Converted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission to heal the world. Hmm. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is. Yeah. Oh. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees, or to be more precise, on bee predators. Hmm. Hmm. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So yes. nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. A carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Uh, okay. Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee What the hell? Oh my god. I got a damn laser beam. This shit, is, the haptic feedback is going crazy. <laughs> this is so silly, but this is so much fun. Pew 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 pew. <laughs> yeah, they, they just made a drone to murk <laughs> murk murk the bees, bro. Or the the wolves, the bee wolves. That shit is crazy, man. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about twenty five hundred bees. That's a lot. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. Smarty pants, that's me. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting edge proton beam work using protons instead of x rays. Mm. Better targeting and less radiation. Mm -hmm. It's all the stuff mm -hmm. we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. Mm. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Hey, it's Connors. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope, I've never been better. That's what worries me. 
Nice to see you again. Your character is the lizard. Embarrassing. Second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. I'm gonna disappear by the time you're ready, so you know. Exploring time, let's go! What's this? So that was crazy. Hey, this is from the first game with the arms and the, the thing. Very interesting. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. Mm. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Mm -hmm. Playful, but not tasteless. Mm. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Get your badge on you, boy. Your badge. Badge. Not the office that got like a thousand windows. Where's my privacy? Out the window. How did he get that? Where did he get that picture from? Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just. Things are really hectic right now. <laughs> <laughs> when I was in treatment, all I could think about was. What would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. Mm. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and make proud, huh? He's guilt tripping me. Stop. It's making me feel bad. It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> oh, one quick thing. <laughs> Man, he had that all set up. That's crazy. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? Yo, we got Coney Island. Researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. 